but considering all the Empire has done to them, I doubt they'll be willing to listen to us. That's why I need to borrow Terra's power. Terra is the only one who can bridge the gap between human and Esper. Yeah, pretty much. I mean, she's the only half-breed, so... I have a Magitek armor transport ship moored in the port of Albrook. I had hoped to send it to Crescent Island all with all haste. Would you please go on board? Yeah, yeah, we might as well. I have my top general and some of his troops accompanying you as well, General Leo. Yeah, Leo's pretty badass. Where the fuck did he come from? There's no door over there. I'm General Leo, pleased to make your acquaintance. Didn't I see that guy in Doma? Oh, right, he was the one with principles. So that's General Leo, eh? Apparently Sabin's Canadian, eh? <laughs> uh, I'll be waiting for you in Albrook. Sweet. Ah, <sighs> la 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 la. Please find the Espers and convince them to cease their attacks. You're our only hope. I say we let them just keep going and just destroy your entire city. I think that sounds like a plan. If Terra goes, I go. <laughs> Locke, thank you. Yes, Locke and his stupid self self-fulfilling prophecies of protecting every woman he comes across. The rest of you stay here. I smell a rat. As do I. It's hard to trust the Emperor just like that. <laughs> I think a Mog's just sitting over there just chilling out. We'll remain here and watch for anything out of the ordinary. Thanks. You'll be our eyes and ears. Keep your guard up! Right, you be careful too. Do I not get a third party member or am I only stuck with Locke and Terra? Apparently I'm only stuck with Locke and Terra. Uh, okay. There's nobody else. There's nothing else up here. I don't believe. Do I not get a third party member? What the fuck? I mean, oh, actually, I think I know. I might know why they've done that. Okay, you want to go down? The war is over. The war is over. This is, both these doors lead to the same place, don't they? Yes, they do. Okay. Now, one last little bit of, of uh, fun to do in here, I believe. Let's see. Oh, I can't even move. <laughs> What do you want? I bear a message from the Emperor. Due to your decorum at tonight's banquet and your grace in speaking to our soldiers beforehand, the Emperor has decided upon the following. All Imperial troops will be withdrawn from South Figaro immediately. In addition, Imperial forces will be withdrawn from the Kingdom of Doma. We will also unlock the armory at the Imperial Observation Post to the east. You are welcome to any of the weapons and armor within. And this is a personal gift from the Emperor. Uh, Tintin Abolum. <laughs> Finally, I was told to give you this because of your impeccable behavior at dinner. Obtained ward, Bengal. Well, then, if you'll excuse me. Yeah, if you talk to every single soldier and you answer all the questions correctly, you uh, you get, well, basically that. A couple of them don't really make a difference at all, but... Uh, how are the espers doing? I haven't even checked in a while. Oh, you're almost done, but not quite. Uh, Bismarck. Oh, you're not done. Uh, let's see here. Ultima Weapon, yeah, Ultima. I don't, I don't know if Ultima Weapon is... I think it is stronger, but it's just... I'm not sure. It's bound to the wielder's HP, and unfortunately, because I also have a green beret on, um, it, it's based on my HP only being, like, fuck, I don't even know, like, 600 or something, so it, it's actually really weak, so... I just have to deal with uh, it being weaker. I'm gonna leave the Assassin's Dagger on. Uh, let's see, relics, hero's ring, Genji glove, white cape, these sprays. Yes, I don't even have any of those French shoes, but whatever, it's fine. Let's see, Albrook's a port town to the south of the Empire. The plan is to leave for Crescent Island from Albrook on a transport ship carrying Magitek armor. We'll keep a close watch on the Empire. You deal with the Espers. Oh, god damn it. Okay, can we stop? Thank you. The Emperor prison keep. Okay. Uh, yes, yeah, so you all, you all still say the same thing. So let's just. Uh, I want to check out the prison. Since we know where Keep is now. Uh, let's see. Oh, there's Cyan chilling out in here. Alright. <laughs> freaking out. Gah, how dare they put me in a place like this? <laughs> I just can't believe it. <laughs> I think he's uh, losing it a little bit. <laughs> what a bore. And Terra's just, like, blinking her eyes, like, what the fuck was that? Random-ass guy. Uh, Alright, well, nothing else left to do in here, so we've done all we can, actually. What was that one relic? Um, Ward Bangle. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Let's see. Coll collar with a small bell that rings as the wearer walks with Taurus HP with each step taken. Yeah, it's pretty funny. Uh, bronze wristband enchanted with the protective ward lowers the rate of random enemy encounters. Mm. As... I'm using as that sounds. I don't want to lower my uh, stuff right now, so. 
Yeah. Just because, I mean, the experience is, is good. Is good. So it's like... If I lower my counter rate, I'll lose the experience I would get normally, and I'd start losing some other stuff, and it'd just be whatever. But yeah. The war, it's really over. Okay, get out of my way. I'm trying to talk to Bannon. So that's what Gestalt said. Team up with the Empire and look for the Espas. Hmm. I don't think he trusts them at all. It does make sense. We can't just leave the Espas alone. Why not? <laughs> they seem to be perfectly willing to kill the Empire. I mean, the rest of the world is already basically dead. I mean, really. I mean, the Empire has basically screwed over half these cities. <laughs> Alright, well, um... Let's see. I don't think there's anything else to do here, so we might as well head out. Uh, okay. I'm yawning again. Hmm. Actually, what I want to do is I want to go over to the Imperial camp over here. As they said, it uh, is now open. Ugh, grass worm. Oh, that's right. I only got like two people in my party now. This kind of blows. <laughs> I think I might just move them to the back row because... Uh... Can we get an instant death, please? God damn it. I know it works because if, it, if, it, if the enemy is immune to death, it actually will kill them and then revive them instantly. So, And I'm pretty sure it revives them at full health, too. I think I'm gonna move these guys to the back row just for for now, just because I know they're both friggin' auto attackers basically right now. I mean, Terra has her magic, but it's like I don't really want to waste a ton of my magic right now. It's Dawn Wyvern. Oh hell, I can probably just use my magic. Uh, let's see if I can cast Drain. Drain's a nice little spell. Actually, that's really useful. <laughs> I don't know why I'm stealing potions. Let's just speed this up. Just kill them, please. Tackle. Yeah, I think I need to just keep draining. Wing sap. Oh, great. Now I'm going to be losing health periodically. That's that's fantastic. That's it, 93. That's not good. Man, am I ever glad I don't have a time limit, because this is taking forever. Okay, can we just freaking get set this thing on fire, please? Yay! Yay, fiery death, Cyclonic. Oh, god damn it. Barrage dive. Oh, he just used his desperation attack. <laughs> well, there you go. Most people actually can go through this entire game without... Oh, haste. With, uh, without ever seeing a desperation attack. So actually getting to see that right there is actually quite amusing. Desperation attacks basically are almost like limit breaks. They're like the first iteration of limit breaks that uh, Squares used. Basically, the lower your health is, the higher chance you get of using it or something. And since both uh, characters just got sent to really low health, obviously, uh, uh, Locke decided to use his. So that kind of worked out. Alright, so note to self, kill the wyverns first. Let's just start using, uh, try thunder. But yeah, so there you go. That's uh, the first desperation attack I think I've managed to use in this game so far. So there, there we go. Uh, do you have any level to you do? Okay. Your magic won't be anywhere near as strong as Terra's, but at least it can hurt them. Uh, yeah, it wasn't even anywhere near the same strength, but still did the trick. Hopefully Terra can just finish it off. Yeah, alright, we're good. Cool. Now we have to slowly whittle away this dog's health. I don't want to trance, I want to just use some spells. Uh, let's just cast fire. I think fire killed you in one shot before. Yep, sure did. <laughs> Of course, now these two are getting experience that the others aren't, but whatever. Imperial Observation Post. But yeah, basically all I'm doing here is just getting that door that was locked previously is now uh, now gracefully open. So hey, I can now, if, you know, I can open it and steal everything! Yay, Angel Wings! X-Potion! Uh, nothing in the thing. Flame Tongue! Alright. It's a bunch of gill. Is it chill? Is it reflect Ring? Alright. Reflect rings are actually more useful than you might think. Uh, let's see, 20,000. Hermes sandals. Hi, Ether. Oh, man, look at me go. 8,000 gill. Angel ring. Elixir. Alarm ring. Now, uh, was there... I'm trying to remember if there was an... I think there was an item. Yeah, there we go. Elixir. It's kind of hidden there. They just want to be big jerks about hiding items. I could have sworn there was... Is there anything else? No, it doesn't appear to be... Alright, checking nothing in the, in the buckets. Doesn't appear so. Um, okay. I think that's it. There we go. So we get to, we were able to rob the hell out of this place. In all of its glory. So, yeah. Can we go? Alright, so now we can head to Albrook. Uh, you wanna leave? Thank you. Now we can head to Albrook on the ever so long walk back over here. It's actually not that far away, I suppose, but... Oh, I love this old world music. I really do. Fossil... Oh, shit. Fossil Dragon. 
Uh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm just going to use a Phoenix Down on you. I'm pretty sure this is the Fossil Dragon I'm thinking of. Yeah, let's just cast Buzz there. Pretty sure that kills it instantly, so... At least it better. Yay! Fossil Dragons are kinda douchebags, so... <laughs> I just don't even wanna... Whoa, okay, that just obliterated the crap out of them, that's good. Lots of kill from these guys, though. Alright, so actually, yeah, that wasn't that far away at all. Sweet! Hey, what are you still doing? Who would have thought we didn't ally with the Returners? Now we can all leave in peace again! Yeah, sure. They said they would be reopening the harbor, reopening the harbor soon. Some life should start flowing back into this town now. You're an item shop. Do you have any eye drops? Because I know I used a bunch of them in that one cave. You do. All right, sweet. Let's just buy freaking like 30 of these things. <laughs> uh, I got some high potions. Let's just get, let's get 12. Uh, let's see remedies. No, they're so bloody expensive. Phoenix down. 10 teleport stone. Yeah, I know I have the teleport spell, so that's not really needed. Uh, let's see. Else. I don't think there's anything else to do here. I've already, like, explored all of these cities, so it's not like it really matters. Anyway, time to head to the port. Do, 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 do. Sweet. What's up, guys? Nothing out of the ordinary report. All's well. I couldn't believe it when I heard the news that the Espers had attacked the Empire. Yeah, you better believe it. They uh, completely destroyed your asses. That's what you get. General Lee is waiting for you. Is he now? Well, then let's just go talk to him. Sup, buddy? Ah, there you are. Another Imperial General and a man I hired back in town will be accompanying us as well. Oh, man, bet you... Oh, look who it is. Let me introduce them. Genesis and Shadow. <laughs> is something the matter? No, it's nothing. We depart tomorrow. In the meantime, I've arranged lodging for you at the inn. Please try to get some rest. That's why we can only bring two people, because he brings Solis and Shadow along. Dot, 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 dot. Yeah, she's got nothing to say to him. Oh, you two are so stupid. <laughs> you guys are so dumb. Oh, Solis. <laughs> What's up, Shadow? I'm working for the Empire, but don't worry. They didn't hire me to kill you. <laughs> I could probably... Well, actually, you no. Know, you're probably one of the few people that I probably wouldn't be able to... Yay, doggy. Alright, we need to head over to the inn. I think. I'm pretty sure that's what the game was implying, so... Alright, where's the inn? That's the relic shop. There's the inn. Yay, in! As opposed to out. Uh, let's see. Generally, you generally already made arrangements for your stay here tonight, by all means. So wait, I'm not even controlling them now. Yay for being lazy! <sighs> oh, here we go. Um. <sighs> oh, something's up with lock. Where the hell's the innkeeper? <laughs> I know it's nighttime, but there's people who probably come in at night looking for lodging. We've already been told that it was a lie to keep what Keith just said. I don't understand what the hell the problem is between you two. So these. Please. Why won't you talk to me? I know I doubted you if only for a moment, but we can still be friends, right? Sleaze! Yeah, she's... Well, I guess I can understand why she's a little upset, because he believed what Kivka said like a dipshit, so Locke is the big idiot here. I think that's pretty much uh, confirmed at this point. Locke, you're a dumbass. Let's just leave it at that, eh? Let's just leave it at that indeed, because, uh, yeah. I don't... Like, in all honesty, honestly, why would you believe the fucking mad, mad, crazy fucking clown that just told you something? Like, really? You really think he's telling the truth? I don't know, Locke is an idiot. And Slee is, is uh, pretty upset about that, so... Kinda shitty. Hopefully they get over it. I study mo- okay. The ones on this continent seem to be exceptionally... Yeah, whatever the hell I said, something to do with magic. I like how everyone is always about, like... When I, I guess this is, like, the capital of Vector or whatever, but... Even still, like, ever, the whole beginning of the game goes on and on about how, like, rare magic is, and how it's, like, not used by anybody. And yeah, there's this random guys around here, like, Oh man, it's really effective to use magic against these guys! <laughs> The Magitek Armor is undergoing maintenance. What Magitek Armor? Oh, right there. Sorry, I'm discussing our plans with General Leo right now. Alright, let's go. Yes, let's go indeed. So I need, I'm pretty sure I need to re-equip Silesian's Shadow, but... Oh, man. Yeah, this is actually uh, quite, uh, quite the boat ride, uh, if I remember correctly. <laughs> yeah, because we're going... I don't know if you can see my mouse, but we're going all the way out the hell up here, if you look at the mini-map, so... 
It's a bit of a bit of a 